the best oil filter cartridge for your vehicle to be used on a 2017 Toyota Corolla. Now, we'll be using the Fram Ultra Synthetic Mobile One Fram Tough Guard k and Select Super Tech oil filter as well. Guys, you're not gonna believe this one. Both of these filters match up, but one at half the cost. Now, find out which one is being made by another company. This way you can save a lot of money on a really great quality oil filter. We're even gonna include the Toyota OEM filter so we can show this one for a comparison as well because many believe that OEM is the only way to go. But you're gonna be surprised on this one, guys. I mean, just check it out. We have the chart lined up for a perfect comparison. All the brands listed, as you can see, the cost, oil change interval mileage, filter media used, the micron rating, and efficiency. There's only a couple of things to note before we get started. The k and filter, guys, well, it's the same exact type used, but not the exact filter used for the Toyota Corolla. This one's a little bit bigger, but they're built the same. Now you can see the cost, Fram Ultra Synthetic, 1097, Fram Tough Guard, 897, Super Tech 548, Mobile One, 997, Toyota 697, K&N, 997, Oil Change Interval Mileage, 20,000 miles for the Fram Ultra Synthetic. 15,000 miles for the Fram Tough Guard. Super Tech, 20,000 miles. Mobile One, 20,000 miles. Toyota, 7,500 miles. K&N, 20,000 miles. Something you guys should know, they all recommend to follow the manufacturer's recommendations. But this is what the filters are capable of doing. Filter Media, Synthetic Blend for Fram Ultra, Synthetic Blend for Fram Tough Guard, Synthetic Blend for the Super Tech, Send blend for the Mobile One, cellulose for Toyota, send blend for the K&N. So they're all the same except for the Toyota using the lowest quality media. Micron rating 20 for Ultra, Fram Tough Guard 20 as well, 30 for the rest of the filters micron ratings. But let me tell you something guys, the Fram Ultra, as you can see, if you look at the site that I'm referencing or any other Fram referencing places, they'll tell you that they use an average group rating testing. So I definitely have my doubts. Not to say they aren't good quality filters. 99% efficiency use for all of these filters, except for one, and that's the Toyota. Now, I will say this, the K&N filter is definitely a good quality filter, but you can see that this Fram Ultra Synthetic is probably the best filter if you want long engine oil drain intervals. However, it does have the highest cost. And since it's using a double ply medium, it could unfortunately cause the flow rate to be decreased. Here we have the Fram Tough Guard. Now it's definitely not near as good as the Fram Ultra Synthetic. However, it's decent quality and for a little bit lesser price, it doesn't have reinforced uh, steel backing with a steel screen and it's not two ply. But look at these filters, identical. The K&N on the right, yes, unfortunately it's for a different um, vehicle, but it's the same type used. Now, on the left hand side, we have the SuperTech. So you can see the K&N is actually making their filter elements. Now the O-rings, they all seem pretty good for most of these oil filters. However, here is the Mobile One, and I would say that they use a really good synthetic media blend, but now it doesn't seem to be one of the best filters. It seems to be similar to me as the Fram Tough Guard, which definitely gets the job done, no problem there. O-ring as well perfectly fine. Now here's the problem. This is probably the worst filter of this group without a doubt. I mean really Toyota OEM filter they couldn't do any better job than this. I mean they definitely spared every expense and the o-ring is one of the lower quality o-rings along with the Fram Tough Guard. 
they use this low quality natural rubber. So Fram Ultra Synthetic is the best for long oil drain intervals. But as I said, it's a little bit strange with the 20 micron rating for both. You'll have to look at the site. It's not really clear on everything. The SuperTech is the best filter you can get here shown now or best quality filter at the lowest cost. On the other hand, again, the worst filter here is Toyota. So is there anything you guys can add that could help out? That's what Nate's Interactive Auto or NIA Community is all about. Thanks for watching.